Listen. What is it? I'm in the middle of an important call. This might be worth putting your family on hold. Here's that data you were worried about. Is that the Carosa Generational Archive? Oh, I am so sorry for being rude. My whole family has been worried. That data is irreplaceable. I didn't think I'd get it back from Nasana's corporate building. If this data is so important, why didn't you have backups? We did. A rival family introduced a computer virus and our techs were sloppy. The virus destroyed all our data. I just spent a fortune getting the data recovered and reconstructed when Nasana went crazy. We live in a world of infinite data redundancy. To lose something so important because of one crazy Asari? Why is this data so important, anyway? It's a genetic history for the entire Carosa family. It's used for high-level reproductive negotiations. It would be like a human... pedigree, I suppose. Without it, you're bargaining from a greatly weakened position. Losing this would have hurt my family for generations, maybe even destroyed it. There's your data. I hope it helps your family. You have no idea, human. I, I don't know who you are or how you got it, but thank you. Here, for your trouble. Blessings be upon you. You've certainly blessed us. Many human refugees, terminus orphans, and former slaves abandoned by Batarian raiders. For many, the adjustment is difficult, but one man... Lots of money here. Soft people who'd make good victims. This place is one bad day away from becoming Omega. Twenty-five. Sell at twenty-five. No, no, no. You're not hearing me. I want to buy it up. Buy it all up. Come on. Come all right. On. Let's do it. Excellent. So the total comes to 116,420 credits. Oh, of course. I Coming up later today, we release our annual list of Ilium's 10 richest people. Are the heavens still bright, Asari? or anything if we go natural. I'm telling you, this is why you shouldn't date humans. So then, I had to explain about cross-species fluid contact. Completely killed the mood. Not to mention that you're a Quarian. How could he be so insane? Ms. Lawson, I'm glad you've made it. We've had a complication. What happened? Is Ariana all right? She's fine, but you listed a man named Niket as your trusted source. He contacted me, warning that your father has sent Eclipse mercenaries to make a sweep. He suggested that the Mercs might be watching for you personally. He's offered to escort Oriana's family to the terminal instead. What information do you have about the mercenaries? I've confirmed that they're Eclipse, and that they're working for an organization Ms. Lawson warned us about. I could try to alert the authorities, but so far they've done nothing illegal. You made the right decision. We'll handle this ourselves. You didn't mention anything about Niket. He's a friend. He and I go back a, a long way. Do you want to bring in any of your other Ilium contacts, Ms. Lawson? No. You and the Ket are the only two I trust on this. Making changes now could be dangerous. Are you sure you can trust Niket? Absolutely. He's one of my oldest friends. I trust him with Ariana. Lentea will follow Niket's suggestion. Shepard and I will take the car and draw their attention. Have Niket escort the family to the shuttle. Give him full access to the family's itinerary just to be safe. Understood, Ms. Lawson. So the plan is for us to get shot down by Eclipse while your sister gets to safety? Eclipse will be under orders to take my sister alive. They won't risk anything that could kill us. I doubt Eclipse will send all their people just to stop you. Do you want to give Niket any backup? Niket can take care of himself. Besides, any armed backup just draws attention to him. 
I'm ready whenever you are, Miranda. Thank you, Shepard. I appreciate this. I hadn't planned on Eclipse, but they never planned on you. Eclipse mercenary gunships. They'll be dropping troops in the cargo areas. Put us down in that cover behind them. Let's hope they really do want to take us alive. Hold fire! I said hold fire, damn it! I got this. Since you're not firing yet, I trust you know who I am. Yeah, they said you'd be in the car. You're the bitch that kidnapped our boss's little girl. Kidnapped? This doesn't involve you. I suggest you take your men and go. I think you've got it all lined up, huh? Captain Inyala's already moving in on the kid. She knows about Niket. He won't be helping you. What do you mean, Niket won't be helping us? Nothing you need to worry about. Nobody's gonna get killed unless you do something stupid. You walk away now, the girl goes back to her father, and everybody's happy. Everybody but my sister. And me. Should we be talking to Captain Inyala about this? You don't want to talk to the Captain. She's not as... polite as I am. She's the best commando I've ever seen. I've seen her tear people in half with her biotics. And she's getting paid a lot to stop you. She gets in my way, she'll never have a chance to spend it. Wait, Miranda, you said she was your twin sister. That what she told you? No, this crazy bitch kidnapped our boss's baby daughter. He's been looking for her for more than a decade. It's complicated, Shepard. We share the same DNA, just not the same birthday. You took a baby from the richest guy in the galaxy, lady. I don't know what your damage is, but you're not getting away with it. I'm giving you one chance to leave. That's more than most get. Captain Inyala ordered us to give you one chance to walk away. This whole time we've been talking, my men have been lining up shots. When I say the word, we unleash hell on your squad. So I suggest you walk away nicely, unless you want... <laughs> Hang on, I've got one of their radios. I'll patch us in, see if I can get an idea of what we're up against. Shepard, I think I owe you an explanation. Ariana is my twin, genetically. 
But my father grew her when I was a teenager. She was meant to replace me. I couldn't let my father do to her what he did to me. So I rescued her. She's almost a woman now. Why didn't you tell me that we were saving a kid? She's not a child. She'll be 19 this year. But, well, it didn't seem relevant at the time, I suppose. There are people who'd use her against me. I'm very protective when it comes to Oriana. I'm sorry I didn't trust you sooner. You deserved to know. I can understand choosing to go your own way, but you stole a young child from her father. If you knew my father, you would understand. I wasn't the first one he made. I was only the first one he kept. I was brought up with no friends, pushed to meet impossible demands. I wasn't a daughter to him. I was... I don't know what I was. Ariana has had a normal life. I made the right decision. If Eclipse knows where Oriana is, they'll be moving in on her soon. We need to hurry. Agreed. I'm a bit worried by what the Merc said. If they've got to Niket somehow, this is going to be harder than I'd planned. According to the specs I reviewed, we'll need to cut through the cargo processing yard to get to Oriana. Can you tell me anything about the cargo processing yard? We'll be moving through conveyor systems. There'll be a lot of movement. Finding targets won't be easy. We'll need to stay sharp. And these cargo transports carry hazardous materials. So watch what you shoot at. I hope your friend can be trusted. Absolutely. Niket is one of my oldest friends. I guess you could say he was my only real friend. He's the only person I didn't cut ties with when I left my father. Is there a chance your father could be using Niket to get to you? I'm sure he's tried, but Niket's one of the few people who understands what my father is really like. I trusted him with my life when I ran from my father, Shepard. He won't betray me now. Let's go find Niket and Oriana. Right. They're on the far side of the conveyor line. Time your shots. I see you, Shepard! Neutralization initiated. Disengaging ah! friend or foe detection. Excuse me. Critical system damage. Backup systems. Engaged. Overloading their systems. 
payload deployed. Divert everyone except my guard from Niket. I'll handle him and the kid personally. Damn it, I'm not letting her get Oriana. Enemies in front! Ah. down through the cargo line. Operatives have attempted to delay you by disabling the elevators. I'm overriding their lockdown. Come on! He goes! Right. Change weapons. Maybe the captain knows we're listening in, and she's feeding misinformation about Niquette making a switch. Or maybe it means something else. Niquette wouldn't do that. Damn it, why won't this thing go any faster? Did Niket know that you took Oriana from your father? No, he just found out about that recently. It was too personal to involve someone else. I never really thought about it, but maybe... No, he'd have to understand why I did it. He knows what I went through. What makes you so sure that Niket wouldn't turn on you? He could have turned on me when I ran away. I'm sure my father tried to buy him off. If he didn't do it then, why would he do it now? The message on the radio seemed pretty clear. He wouldn't betray me. We'll be at the transport shuttle in a moment and we'll clear this up. Listen to me, I've got authorization to change their booking. I'm sorry, sir. We're under security lockdown. Until the situation in the cargo terminal is resolved, no passengers can be rebooked. This isn't worth my time, Niket. I get paid regardless of how the girl gets there. No. I was told that I could handle this my way. We're not traumatizing the family any more than we... Miri. This should be fun.
Niket, you sold me out. How do you want to handle this, Miranda? Why, Niket? You were my friend. You helped me get away from my father. Yes, because you wanted to leave. That was your choice. But if I'd known that you'd stolen a baby... I didn't steal her. I rescued her. From a life of wealth and happiness? You weren't saving her. You were getting back at your father. How did Miranda's father turn you? They told me you kidnapped your baby sister all those years ago. They said I could help get her back peacefully. No trauma to the family. I told them you'd never do that. They could go to hell. Then you finally told me what you'd done. I called them back that night. Why didn't you call me, Niket? We've been through a lot. You could have at least let me explain. I deserve to know that you'd stolen your sister, Miri. I deserve to know you were with Cerberus. But I had to hear it from your father first. How much did Miranda's father pay you? A great deal. Damn it, Niket! You were the only one I trusted from that life. He knew you felt that way. That's why he bought me. So you just took his money? Don't get holy with me, Miri. You took his money for years. I knew Eclipse was willing to get their hands dirty, but kidnapping a kid? I'm not stealing her. I'm rescuing her. Come on, Niket. Let's finish this bitch off and get out of here. Take your best shot. I was just waiting for you to finish getting dressed. Or does Cerberus really let you whore around in that outfit? I like her. Are we still recruiting? Whether or not you agree with Miranda, Oriana has been with her family for years now. Her father can still give her a better life. You don't know what my father wants for her. I know that I've been poor, Miri. I didn't much care for it. He wants to take a girl away from the only family she's ever known. Doesn't that tell you what he really is? If Niket knows about Oriana, then your father does too. Relocating her won't work. Miranda's father has no information about Oriana. I knew you had spy programs in your father's system, Miri, so I kept it private. I'm the only one who knows. Which means that you're the only loose end. This isn't how I wanted it to end, Niket. I'm going to miss you. <laughs> Figuratively speaking. I was tired of talking anyway. So was I. We've been spotted. Smirks near the shuttle. I want to make sure Oriana and her family get on safe. I can't believe Niket sold me out. I didn't even see it coming. Everyone makes mistakes. I'm guessing that's one you won't repeat. Why did he make me kill him? He could have run. He could have lied about having the data stored somewhere. But he just stood there. The only loose end. He knew what I'd have to do. Maybe he didn't think you'd have the nerve to gun him down. No. He knew. All too well. Let's get moving. Right. No sign of Eclipse. It looks like we're clear. There she is. 
she's safe. With her family. Come on, we should go. Don't you even want to say hello? It's not about what I want, it's about what's right for her. The less she knows about me, the better. She's got a family. A life. I'll just complicate that for her. She doesn't need any details, but would it really be so bad for her to know she has a sister who loves her? I guess not. Go on. We'll wait here. Somebody who respects you. Somebody who's going to treat you right. Oh, I think I'm just going to stop dating for a while. No, don't do that. Don't let some human spoil you. It's always the same thing. Ooh, she could get sick. She's... Welcome back, babe. Can I get you anything? Sorry, no sex. Just cleaned the bar. Just looking around. Pleasure as always. for the best tech upgrades you have. Of course, I can help you with a consult and figure out what options work for you. You'll never thank you again. You have no idea what this means to my family. Prefabs? Why not? Pardon me, I'm dealing with damn Ilium travel bureaucracy. Excuse me, but I found a locket with a picture of a human and someone who looks like you. Oh. Stephen. Thank you. Thank you so much. My daughter was young when he died. This is the only memento she has of him. Please accept this. It's much less than I would have had to pay the bureaucrats to authorize a search. Are you a Quarian or Volus who is tired of being passed over for promotions because of discrimination against exo suit wearing employees? Genetic paradigms invite you to consider environmental adaptive therapy. Our trained staff has a success rate approaching 40%. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal.
So, Commander, you figure Miranda would ever lighten up a bit and... I'm, I can't even finish saying it. I assume everything's going well up here? Good for now. Fractured my thumb on the mute, but I think I made my point. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Thanks again, Shepard. Taking the time to help me with my sister. I couldn't have reached Oriana in time without your help. And you proved yourself trustworthy. Unlike Niket, I'm glad I got to take him out myself. That's funny. I think of you as all business. Good to see that there's a person under there. The mission's too important to let personal feelings interfere. But thank you, Commander. My sister is safe again thanks in large part to you. I won't forget that. <laughs>